What is going on, peeps? Bleaker here, and I am back with another episode of Game Dev Tycoon. Now, let's see here. War of the Universe is not the market sold. 49,000 units generating a lot. Not as much as I would have liked in sales, but enough to keep the company afloat. So let's send him on vacation. In the meantime, I want to research a new topic. Sports. Let's do it. We do sports. We do sports ball here. Kicking a goal into the upper 90 for a hole in one. Ah, good. Looks like... I can't even read his name. Wow. Oh, let's... Sheesh here. So now let's research. Anything else I want to look up? Uh, let's start research on that. And I want you to start research... On... Oh... Uh, we'll start research on that. Basically, I'm going to get a setup here, so I'm going to create a custom engine here. I'm going to create a custom engine here uh, very soon. Research. I'm going to blow all my research points right now. Sound, mono, sound. Casual. No. We. Yeah. Casual gaming, you filthy casuals. No, we're not going to do that. Basically, I'm going to blow a whole bunch of money here. Ugh. Yeah, 1.6 million. Yeah, I'm going to blow a, like a whole bunch of money here researching stuff. Quit scratching your heads. You like scratch your head for a week there, people. Uh, no particularly strong trends at the moment. Alright, so that means our strategy trend, I think that's what it was, is gone. Let's quick train you on... Uh... Actually, no, we're not going to train. I need to research some more stuff here. Marketing, I don't really feel like doing anything with marketing yet. Better user experience, I'm going to invest a little bit in. And now we're all out of research, for the most part. So we're going to start a new game here pretty soon. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Very nice. So we're going to create and develop a new game here. It's going to be a everyone small, as I'm not ready for a medium game yet. Sports. We'll call it Sports ball. Sports ball. Um. Ball in the upper. Ball in the upper 90. Ball in the upper 90 for a hole in one. It's going to be a simulation. Uh, do we have anything where simulations are good on the PC? Alrighty. Next. It's gonna be 2D Graphics version 1. So, we know that's not important. Gameplay, I think, is more important than engine. This is all right now just a guessing game. Today, Ninvento announced that the much-anticipated successor to the popular TES announced the much-anticipated successor to the popular TES console. This is the greatest console we have ever built. It comes with a state-of-the-art 16-bit graphic, 16 graphics and sound. It is simply super. That is why we're calling it the Super TES. Okay, nine Vento. Fans around the world have been waiting for this moment, and it seems that they will not be disappointed. Cool. Artificial intelligence important. Level design, important. Dialuge, probably not. And we're doing it. Sound, important. Important, important. The sound is important. Graphics and world design. Actually, world design, we're going to take a risk here. We're going to take a risk here. So basically, I'm going to be researching stuff, or getting research points so I can create a new engine, and you can do a whole bunch of fun stuff with that. And I'll kind of explain when we go to create it. 
New record. Very nice. New combo. Well, that's not a great combo, so that kind of worries me. I'll just kind of zoom past all that. Ethan Fernandez. That was his name. Let's release this bad boy. In the meantime, I want you... Oh, God. First reviews came in for our newly released game, Sports Ball. Ball in the upper 90. A... 7. Alrighty. That's good. Beautiful. I'll take it. Shows potential. Alrighty. And very good. Alrighty. I'll take it. In the meantime, I want you to generate me a game report on Sports Ball Ball in the upper 90. And very nice. Today, new today the new game platform, Super TES by Ninvento. Ninvento has been released. Interesting. Alrighty, we're selling units. We're gaining fans, selling units. Sports and simulation is a great combination. Dialogue seems not very important for this kind of game. Alright. I'm going to research one last thing here. Or a few other things here. Level editor I want to research. And I want you to research... Um, better dialogue. So my thought is we're going to research all this and incorporate it all into the new engine. And then we're going to pretty much trash the new engine and in a couple, I guess, theoretical years. I got 1.4 million. Okay. I would prefer a little bit more money before we go into that. So let's develop another new game. Small game the topic a we're into a fantasy just because I know that works well fantasy RPG if you already know it's a great combo we're gonna try it on the T the super TES we're gonna call it no no I know um for all Pro Fantasy. Fro Frantis Fro Frantasy. Fro Frantasy. <laughs> that is that is kind of funny. We got Fro Frantasy. We know not as important, very important, moderately important. Okay. So since we developed all these game reports, it kind of, you know tells us what's going to be more important and stuff. That's why I've been running these. Ball in the upper 90 is now off the market. We haven't really had a home run in a little while, which is kind of bumming me out. Set my alarm there. So we know an artificial intelligence. No. That. Important. Dialogue. Probably very important. We're winging it. Okay, so where do we stand here? Five. Technology design. Oh boy. World design, graphics, sound, eh. We're winging it. Come on, I need a home run here. Got a lot of design, though. That kind of restores me with hope. A few more technology. The media, the media is abuzz with the latest news from the year's entertainment conference. It is, in a surprise announcement, Vony, a company no known for general electronics, has presented a prototype called the Play System. Hmm, where have we seen that before? Apparently, Vony has collaborated with Invento creators of the beloved and successful TES and Super TES consoles to develop what is basically a Super TES with a CD drive. Oh, huh. this would be the world's first console using a CD. Nice, new record. New combo. What? Uh, journalists around the world are baffled as the only day, as only one day after Vony and Ninvento jointly announced the play system, the entertainment conference things turned sour. Ninvento announced today that they will cancel the project and intend to seek a develop to develop a new console with a different partner. Rumor has it that the distribution deal with the companies had worked out was unfavorable to Ninvento, handing over much of the control to Vony. This seems to be the end of the play system. Hmm. Will it now? Ah, Fro Fantasy. Oh, 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 oh. Nice. Come on, baby. Come on, come on, come on. A masterpiece. Come on, baby. Come on, come on, come on. 
Come on, throw fantasy. Yes! That was really loud. A perfect game. Release a game with a clean score of 10. Come on, baby. Come on. I think we broke the game. Nope. We ranked number one, baby. Two months, the TES will be taken off the market. Alrighty. Come on. Come on. Come on. Two weeks, ranked number one. Come on, baby. Fro Fantasy, the newest game by Bleak Gaming, has caused a storm of good reviews and excited customers. Industry professionals say that Fro Fanny is one of those rare games that will set a new quality standard for future games. It seems that Bleak Gaming has really made gaming history with Fro Fantasy. Fro Fantasy. Fro Fantasy. Well done. Thank you. Ta 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 ta. Wow, we've been number one for a while. Look at that. We're still rank one. This game's not one, two, three, four, five, six weeks, and we were ranked number one. That's the frickin' home run I needed. Good lord. Let's just quick develop a game report here. Look at that. The cost and the income. We've literally profited so much from that. I'm loving it. Look at it. Look at that. Hi boss, I had a knack for security and I think we could really do some security upgrades in our office. I did some research. A lot safer than we are now. Sure, why not? Thanks, boss. I'll get right to it. You're welcome, Ethan. The TES is no longer support. You released four games on the platform and earned a total of... It's not a very much... That's not very much money. Okay, cool. 3.1 million in sales. Alright, that's what I needed. Custom game engine time. So, we're going to call this one the... Bleakest. The bleakest 1.0. Linear story, simple cutscenes. We're basically going to throw in everything we can. Save games, game tutorial, better user experience, better dialogue, better level design, open world, and mono sound. Let's create this bad boy. Fortunately, we work pretty fast. We shouldn't be losing too much money. I think the monthly costs are going to be what kills us here. Come on, guys. Work faster here. Come on. Come on, baby. Actually, with as much money as I have, I'm thinking about hiring another position. That'll be something to do. Done. The bleakest 1.0 is now complete. That's good. So, we're going to send you on vacation. And we're going to fill your position with somebody... Complex algorithms. Actually, game demo. Let's... Oh, I don't want to fire you. Not while you're on vacation. After you're off vacation. Hmm. 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 Well, this guy blows everybody. Nicholas Vargas. Change your last name to Cage and you're hired. Wow. Nerd! Staff welcome. Very nice. Let's train you up here. So you got some decent speed, you got good design, good technology. And you've got good design, great technology. I'm gonna bump up your game design. I'm gonna have you train on your speed. And then I'm gonna train myself on nope, nope, I wanna train myself on um Eh, I'll give myself that. Hi again, I've heard that you've been very successful in the gaming business and are starting to grow your team. I've updated our client list, so if you're looking for some contract work, let me know. Jason. Medium-sized contracts have been unlocked. Cool. 
Alrighty, so everybody's getting trained up here. This is gonna be my design guy, it will be Ethan. Actually, I'll probably be the design guy. Let's do one more training exercise here. Technology design. I wanna do one more design here. Oh, RPG games are especially popular at the moment. Oh, hurry up with your freaking training, man. Alrighty, let's take Nicholas for a test run here. In a moment. Alrighty, so we're gonna develop a new game. It's going to be a small... Small... about vampire RPG. Well, what do you know the RPGs excel on here? Sure, we'll wing it. Pick game engine, the bleakest 1.0. And we're gonna call it... We'll call it, um... Oh boy. Vampires RPG. <laughs> it's stupid, but whatever. Next. 2D graphics version 2. We're going to spare no expense on this. Gameplay is important. Yes, yes, yes. Linear story, simple cutscenes, save game, game tutorial, better user experience. Next. I need some more uh, design people, I think, in my next hiring. Better dialogue, level editor, okay. Wow. So, 2D graphics version 2, mono sounds, open world. Let's do it. Dear Bleak Gaming, we have been following your progress in... I feel like I should see this in accent. Dear Bleak Gaming, we've been following your progress in recent years and would like to extend this formal invitation to participate in the biggest game convention on the planet, Games Games Games, also known as G3. By having your own company booth at G3, you can gain a lot of fans and hype for your games. Oh god, I can't do that. And we think our audience would love to see you there. We will contact you yearly with booth options. Hope you see you there at the G3 committee. Cool. Let's work out these bugs here. And come on. Let's see how this bad boy does. Yay, leveled up gameplay. 2D graphics version 2. Alright, let's release this bad boy. Character progression. That would have been nice. The first reviews for our newly released game, Vampires RPG, came in. Very enjoyable. Alrighty, I'll take it. Love it. They loved it. They love it! Outstanding game. Very nice. And played it for days. Perfect. And we're selling units. Rank 22. Very nice. Let's generate a game report here. Select. Let me just... Actually, I better end it here, folks, before I get too far out of hand. So until next time, guys, hopefully we'll come back and... I know we can move to another office after this. Oh, let's see. Vampire and RPG, great combination. Dialogue seem to be very important. Platform genre match. Good. Everyone good. Great. Potential. Perfect. So until next time, guys, be seeing ya.